Happy 2023. Welcome to Amy's Solar Cooking for Dummies. Today we're going to be doing a recipe from one of my all-time favorite cookbooks, The Nightmare Before Dinner. This is from the uh, LA and New York restaurant Beetle House. I still haven't gone to the restaurant, but I like their book. We will be making the Sriracha Roasted Butternut Squash Death Soup. I've made it a couple times, it's really good, but I've never made it in the solar oven. We'll be using the solar oven for two parts of the recipe. First, for actually roasting the vegetables, and then once everything is blended and assembled, we're gonna put it back in the oven and heat it up to eat. Let's go! Well, ain't that purdy. We've got our butternut squash and onions ready to go. So this is uh, some diced butternut squash. Some There's a whole red onion in there that's been cut up and then it's been mixed with olive oil, ground coriander, ground cinnamon, garlic powder, smoked paprika, ground nutmeg, and sea salt. Let's get it in the oven. Looks like it's in perfect focus. I'm gonna come back in an hour and see how tender these are. As demonstrated by the sun site, it has been one hour. We've got some moisture on the bag. That's a good sign. Let's see how it's doing. Oh, it smells amazing. We're getting there. Gonna readjust and give it another 30 minutes. It's been 30 minutes. Let's check it out. It's getting there. I'm gonna do another 30 minutes. Okay, another 30 minutes. This should be good to go. We just had some uh, some clouds coming in, so that's why this is a little, but it just came in. So I think, I don't think it should have affected the cooking time. Oh yeah, perfect. So now that the squash and onion are cooked, we are going to transfer this to a blender and I'm going to add some almond milk it's supposed to be vanilla soy milk. I couldn't find vanilla soy milk, so it's also vanilla almond milk. And uh, some sriracha, we're gonna blend it up and then I'm gonna put it back in the pot. Our soup is nice and pureed. All right, I'm gonna give it about, I think 30 minutes. That looks pretty good. It's a thick soup. <laughs> And to totally finish it off, I'm going to add a little more sriracha and then some chopped walnuts. Ah, oh, yeah. Ah, oh, yeah. And here we go. Mm. So good. So much flavor. Nice and hot. Yeah. Thanks for watching. I'm a full of cooking for dummies.